So I have a few rocks that I suspect to be meteorites. The first one I'm going to be cutting is this little one here. And the reason why I suspect these to be meteorites is they're partially magnetic. They're not really magnetic, but they're just a little bit magnetic. So I'm not going to really cut it. I'm just going to grind the surface so I can see the inside and see if it looks like meteors I've seen online before. So the next one I'm going to be grinding is also partially magnetic. And it's got these crystals in it. It's dark black and it looks pretty weird. It's not like your average rock. So this rock didn't seem quite as hard as the other one. And we did manage to get a little bit of a polished surface on this one. So this one actually managed to break in the vise, which is kind of a good thing because now I can see what it looks like inside a little bit better. But there is a pretty good polished spot on this rock and it does look pretty cool inside. So we have a bunch of these rocks that we suspect to be meteorites. And the one thing these all have in common is they're all attracted to a magnet. And one of the cooler ones is this flat looking one. It looks kind of like a hamburger. And it's completely black but it also has crystals all over it. And it's pretty cool because it's kind of a weird shape to see in nature. So here's a spot where it broke in the vise. Kind of just looks like a normal rock inside. Once again, excuse the camera quality, it's not doing a very good job of focusing close up. But as you can see, the part that I grinded down is like a mirror. It's pretty much like glass inside. So now last of all, the very first one we ever found, this is the one we suspect to be a meteorite more than any of these. Although this is just a regular iron meteorite. And one of the reasons why we suspect this to be a meteorite is obviously it looks like a meteorite. It's solid iron pretty much. It's extremely magnetic. But most of all, it's got that fusion crust that they're always talking about, that like thin layer of metal on the outside. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see future content. Hopefully in the future we're going to be cutting open more of these, definitively proving if they are or aren't meteorites. And uh, let me know in the comments what you actually think. Do you think these are just regular rocks or are they actually meteorites? And what do you think about the big iron one? I'm pretty sure that is a meteorite. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Make sure to check out round two. I'll be cutting up more of these. Peace out, guys.